There are a few things I enjoy more than playing golf with good friends. This Thanksgiving, I got to tee it up with two of my favorite golf riders and good pals, Sean Martin and Sean Allen. The Seans were both in Tallahassee visiting family for Thanksgiving, and we were able to make a few phone calls and get ourselves a tee time on the wonderful Glen Arvin Country Club. Glen Arvin is loaded with history, including frequent visits by former president Dwight Eisenhower. When you visit Glen Arvin, it's easy to see why Ike was a frequent visitor to the club. It's an absolutely gorgeous golf course, and on a day like we got, it was the perfect place to kick off our Thanksgiving holiday with a little gathering of friends. For our outing at Glen Arvin, we set ourselves up a nice little skins game to have some friendly competition. I should mention that that competition included a lot of wise cracks and some really oh. bad golf jokes. <laughs> Sorry, I was not going to say action. I thought you were going to ask this question. Yeah. Oh, I could do that, I suppose. Yeah. No, this is a beautiful course. It, I think it's a, indicative of South Georgia, tall pines, closely mowed fairway, um, beautiful greens, firm, um, relatively fast. Uh, love the collars and the undulations. It's been it's a ton of fun. Plus, you get a lot of hot takes. A lot of hot takes. Um, I'm, more, I'm not from a mild takes. Yeah. Glen Arvin's about as pretty of a golf course as you'll ever find. The towering pine trees of southwest Georgia meet beautifully with the rolling fairways that fall over the hills. <whistles> Glen Arvin is always a great treat and it was especially fun to be able to tee it up there with two of my good friends and fellow riders. We jokingly referred to our match that day as the Writer Cup, which was filled with lots of fireworks, both for good shots and for Eject. some bad. Can we get the uh, Pro Tracer on the club? I was trying to hit a draw, and I have no idea why. Like, just hit it. You're driving it fine. I think you know, um, unnamed writers who we don't think, you know, think are great. And, Andy, you know, <laughs> Uh, we love Andy, by the way. Contrarian views on width and angle school of school of architecture. How do you feel about the ball? Because this course feels kind of. You did make eagle on a bar five. <laughs> yeah, with a four iron. I, I, it's kind of like cheating. Um, I'm pro roll back the ball. I think we need more iron, better iron players like myself to succeed. And that would be great on tour, right? Should oh yeah, absolutely. Roll it back, make them bring what? bring back the middle middle game again. It's like the it's like the mid range jumper. It's lost lost art. Martin, what's what's the tour's official position on that? I, I'm not qualified to speak on that, actually. <laughs> uh, if we could just get the five families to get together, which is really unified, and we know who has to lead that. We know who is the heavy. The PGA? <laughs> yeah. The players. It's, it's the players. It's a lot of taste piece, PGA. I don't, I don't <laughs> want to be a part of. I do love the golf course. I love the greens complexes. Nice funnels that you can work the ball close to the hole, but if you do miss, you're going to pay the penalty and have a tough up and down. So It's firm. Greens have some firmness in them. Uh, like two bags of sand. Yeah. 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 Warm bags of sand. Warm, warm bags of sand. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so the course is great. The takes are bad. Yeah. The course at Glen Arvin is great indeed, and it's a wonderful place to go for a walk. People playing the course will find a wide variety of shots over a vast array of interesting golf holes. There are areas mown tight so you can putt from far off the green and there are swales and adventurous surroundings all around the putting surfaces. Every hole offers a unique opportunity to learn something about yourself and the game that you're playing. The tee shots all require your full attention and the course is just flat out fun to play. Oh my goodness. Wow, both straight. Great ball is like a draw. Glen Arvin was looking particularly gorgeous on the crisp November evening in which we all gathered to play there. 
the boys had never seen the course before and really loved taking it all in. I should mention that these guys are tremendous writers. Sean Allen has been featured in the Golfer's Journal and other online publications. And Sean Martin is a full-time contributor for PGATour.com, covering some of the best players in the world. You would think with that experience, Martin would be a little bit better at rolling the rock on the greens, but yikes, he's not. All jokes aside, these guys are a lot of fun to play with, and they're always good to chat with, both uh, via text messages when sharing ideas about writing and thinking up ideas of how to talk about golf in a fun way next. Being a writer in today's world is not what it once was. <laughs> Nowadays, you have to have a social media presence in order to be competitive in a oversaturated industry. And for three writers who got to know each other on social media, it was great to be able to come together and spend some time on the golf course. Oh, shit. So bad. That's a so Hideki, man. So bad. Big Hideki move. Because at the end of the day, you can only have great moments with friends when you're actually with friends in person. Oh, he's done it. Did he lock it up? Yeah, lock it up. Oh, man. How's man. it feel? That's why I like to play skins games. It's not an <laughs> uh, aggregate score. It's just go out there and it only takes one, only takes two. It literally took you two. But enough about these guys. Let's focus for a second on my beautiful approach shot into the 18th green where I knocked it on in two, firing up what's known as Cardiac Hill. This is the hill that Dwight Eisenhower made famous during his frequent trips to Glen Arvin during his presidency. His doctor told him after a heart attack that if he could climb the hill on his own, he was free to run again for re-election. You can just call me Mr. President. Oh, it skipped the trap. You're on the green. Yeah. Playing golf with the Shans was a perfect way to kick off my Thanksgiving holiday. We had a great time exploring the environments of Glen Arvin Country Club, which is always one of my favorite places to visit. From the moment you arrive at Glen Arvin, all the way through the last hole, and certainly as you arrive into the bar for a drink after your round, you're overcome by a sense of something special around you. You're filled with a sense of history, and there's a smile on your face from start to finish. I'm all about playing golf in amazing places, but nothing really beats playing with friends that you really enjoy being with. I had an absolute blast playing with Sean Martin and Sean Allen at Glen Arvin for the inaugural Ryder Cup, and we can't wait to tee it up and do it all again next year. Watch out. Watch out. Get you some.